Stable has not been able to rise because of you. You got all these kids around here saying, Vega, Vega, Vega. That was pretty good. The mama's back. And tensions are boiling over in the Texas zone. Here comes Vega Storm. The fight, the Black Mama. Black Mama, double leg takedown. Man, this is crazy. We just got out of a triple threat. And you gotta imagine how angry, how intensely enraged Vega the Kid Storm is after what happened on our last broadcast here on Intensity. Come on! Come on! Come on! Right here! Let's go! Come on! Right here! Come on! Come on! Fuck the tiger! Come on! Come on! Fuck the tiger! Let's go! Come on! I'll prove it to you! I'll prove it to Stable! I'm better than you! Come on! You've been everybody in GWC and sell me! You've never been in the ring with me! Never been in the ring with me! Come on. I'm gonna hurt you, Vega! Come on. I'm gonna hurt you, boy! Come on. Come on. To all our viewers all over the web, it's time for the longest running backyard wrestling promotion in history to bring you a show featuring a roster of some of the most brutal brawlers in the history of the sport. Ladies and gentlemen, it's GWC in history. And as we continue our trek to the vast counties of Georgia, we'd like to thank all our viewers and longtime subscribers who have stuck with us all these years. We've been in business since 98, and this week we're coming to you once again from Macon, Georgia, the focal point of culture in the South, ladies and gentlemen, outside of the great city of Atlanta, one hour down 75. Guys, you are here. Where high society and the hood meet, where cherry blossoms flourish, and there's always green at your feet. Oh, and don't forget about Ventures, Crystal, and a little fish on Friday. Guys, welcome back to GWC Intensity. Getting ready for some one-on-one -on -one action between Vega, the Kid Storm, and the Black Mamba, Cliff Balcom. In this long-awaited clash this week, in which I can only surmise that the Black Mamba wanting to affirm that Stable is still in control, shutting down this upstart, Vega the Kid Storm, who has just been in a whirlwind over the past few weeks. And we're seeing now Vega, who has fought his way out of a beautiful side headlock by the Black Mamba and followed up with a shoulder block tackle, guys, as we get ready to start this thing off here. Man. And one has to know the Black Mamba is more than prepared to take this kid the distance if need be as they tie up again. Look at this right here. Vega gets the arm. It's a wrench in there. He's got control. As now for a double wrench, getting more torque. Oh, look at that. Cliff Balkum rolls through and gets loose. Beautifully executed. Giving Vega time for pause. As he's going to have to reassess his approach. As he gets ready here. Look at this. Like We're going to square off again. These two not met very often in the ring. I have to stay. Look at that kick to the midsection. Having to study each other a little bit. But man. One thing the Black Mama is known for is those vicious strikes. I mean... Those things are just body bruising hits. The GWC has seen its fair share of stiff hitters. I mean, you look back at such figures like the Widowmaker or the Georgia boy Kirk Killens or even CJ Lennon. And man, those guys used to beat people to death. And if you look back, I mean, you can check the channel. I mean, check out some of John Forge's matches. And, of course, who could forget the brutality of Shane Marks and those concussion-inducing blows he would deliver to his opponents in every match. And, I mean, the, if you want intensity, you definitely can check out some of these videos on the channel and see how badly some of us have been beaten over the years as Vega the Kid Storm gets some retaliation, goes for the vertical suplex. Beautiful! Beautiful! I say this a lot, but... 
uh, people truly underestimate just how devastating Boy. a basic vertical Boom. suplex can be. I mean, man, just people need to reassess their thoughts on such a thing because it is a, a painful endeavor. Guys, you're watching the action here on intensity as the Black Mamba Cliff Falcon. With a vicious roundhouse to the back of the kneecap. Oh man, that had to suck. Look at this. Brings him to the center. Oh man. <laughs> Continues to deal out the punishment to make the kid storm. Oh man. This Balkum has picked a limb here. And look at this. He's going to drag the kid to the apron here. And <laughs> unwillingly, here we go. Oh no. Guys, we're at the turn post here. This is not good for the leg that he just... Oh, man! Right into the metal. Look at this. Cliff Balkum. My goodness. <laughs> just taking every opportunity to hurt Vega the Kid Storm as he promised. Man. Taking the time. Going to go ahead and break the count here. Get back to, get back to the punishment on the outside here. Going at the leg. Man, he's going to cross it. Look at this. Going to try to wrench it here. Look at that. Bracing it. And a scissor. Look at that. Just forcing it. A hand applied figure four. Oh, man. And then gets back in the ring to break the count. Look at this right here. Apparently, the damage has been done. As Vega the Kid Storm writhing in pain. They'll drag him to the center. We're going for the cover here. Ladies and gentlemen, here we go. One, two. And no, Vega is still in this thing. Despite the leg pain, man, he's gonna need some ibuprofen. So he needs to the spine, the upper spinal area. As Cliff Balkum continues his offense. Oh man, there's the there's the joint, that ligament-filled joint of the elbow. Once you take the limbs from your opponent, there's nothing else they got. And the Black Mamba makes a good point as he continues on the limbs. And this is bad. Oh, my goodness. Not this. He just, I mean, all the fingers just getting pressed into the mat. Oh! Oh, man. Oh. I'll talk about the pain exchange game. We're in it now. As Cliff Balkum continues to focus on that arm. Look at that. Man, reverse chicken wing. Locked almost yeah. almost the top yeah. wrist lock, but uh, it's definitely locked in, as we can see. As Cliff Balkum trying to get a submission here. Look at that. Stomps the arm for extra measure here. Wondering, is this all you got? And perhaps in grain reaction, Vega the Kid Storm is laughing. I mean, some, for some people, I guess the general reaction is so much pain. Is oh my! Now that was illegal. If I ever saw it, man. The way the way the neck crank was applied there, it, it's almost it, the danger is snapping someone's neck, and we saw this between Maddox and Tony James. Oh my goodness! Double front drop kick right there. On Vega the Kid Storm. Oh, man. The Black Mamba has been skirting the rules this entire matchup as he goes to the cover again. And look at that. Vega the Kid Storm. Seeing an opening and taking it immediately. And he's got, he's got it scissored in. Look at this. And Black Mamba gets to the rope. Man. I'm going to break the hole here. It's Vega the Kid Storm finally finds himself on the offensive. Drop kick returned to the Black Mamba, sending him to the outside. This has been a wild one to start out this week. And you can just see the fight in Vega the Kid Storm. Egging on, saying, Come on, let's go. He is the embodiment of GWC intensity as he continues the fight against the Black Mamba. Look at this. Fisherman Hook gets him up. 
stalling. He's he's holding a fisherman position and fisherman release. Vega has just turned the momentum in this matchup. And he's starting to get an offensive streak here. But if you ask me, he's running out of wind here. And fatigue is starting to set in at a most inconvenient time when he has the advantage. That NWA shit don't cut around here. This is GWC, bitch. Come on, and the Black Mamba reminding Vega the Kid Storm of where he is. And Vega! Vega! Wow! Strikes! Goes for the cover! One! Two! No! He kicks out! And this match continues as tensions run high in the intensity zone. Look at this. Vega the Kid Storm going up. What's he preparing for here? This, he's going to fly. Let's see what he's going to do here. Oh, man. Beautiful flying leg drop. Nails the Black Mamba. Flush. One. Two. No. He still kicks out. Oh, man. Come on. And the Black Mamba continues the show. Why he is one of the most threatening members of this roster. Man, the tenacity. And Vega the Kid Storm refusing to acknowledge anything at this point. He will not concede. And he's going to continue to fight on against this relentless Black Mamba. Ooh. Here comes the pain. Man. Cliff Balkum on the offensive. Oh, and this is bad. We're in Death Valley position. No, wait a minute. Maybe he can't throw something. Oh, he got him. He got him. Oh, man. The kid. He nailed the Black Mamba. One, two. No. Oh, my goodness. He kicked out. The Black Mamba kicked out. As we look back at some of the action here. Man, this has been a contest. And look at this. Black Mamba, back up. Back on the offensive. Still tearing into the kid even after that. Look at that. Here comes Trey. The living nightmare, Trey Thorne, is assaulting the Black Mamba. He has inserted himself into this match. Look at this. Here he comes. Oh! Nails the Black Mamba. But wait a minute. It's John Forge. Oh, my goodness. No! John Forge just put the exclamation point on this disqualification. This match has been thrown out. But it looks like a decisive statement has been made here by Stable. Is the Black Mamba... Stands tall in the ring. Man, who would ever thought Trey Thorne would come out and take the side of Vega in this exchange? Two girls want to fight. Can't speak for him. I'm all for it. So go in there and get it signed up. And I'll see you back here next week. Fuck all that. But chair, bro, you went and broke it. That's what happened. Swing chairs and they break. Told you I can't do it like that. Default stable. I try. I keep forgetting that. I try. But I. Uh, we'll see. Checkmate game over. Nah. My game just started. <sighs> Stay tuned for more action right here on GWC Intensity. Remember our YouTube friends, you can get your official GWC Intensity team shirt from our official shop on Spreadshirt.com. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching. Check us out, subscribe, and we'll see you next time in the zone.